Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Shop Let's Go. My name is Joanne and I am presenting to you today a sleepy Dollar Tree haul. I just got done doing my work week here in Martinsburg, West Virginia. I took a little cat nap and I'm actually going to start heading home to Virginia here in a little bit. But I wanted to show you this small Dollar Tree haul. While I was up here, I went to a few different stores just to kind of see what was going on. And I have just a short, sweet haul for you, so I'm going to get into it. All right guys, I was really excited that I found the short living garland. I love the little cube shapes and then the starfish. I didn't get the other ones. There was um, like the, it was just like sail, sail, sailboats and um, I wanna say it was like the captain's steering wheel, but I got two of them. I'm just so totally excited about that. Loving this. Gonna definitely DIY with it. And then, just because I needed these, if I can grab them, just because I needed these, I grabbed the little multi-pack of paint brushes at one of the Dollar Trees up here. So for Mother's Day, I'm going to invite my aunt over and we're going to have like a little brunch sipping paint. Um, there may be mimosas involved, I'm not quite sure. I mean, me and my sister are probably hoping to have that, but... Um, my aunt, she won't, she'll have coffee. And I got um, these little paint sets. So in my next Dollar Tree haul video, that is gonna be the mega load, you guys. So stay tuned for that one because I got um, the tabletop easels at the Charlottesville Pantop Dollar Tree and this is why I got this because I'm gonna have that Mother's Brunch uh, sipping paint. So there's that. Um, another thing that I found at one of the Dollar Trees here is, look how little <laughs> this vinyl is. So this has, um, so this is permanent vinyl. It's four and a half by 48 inches. And if you can see, I'll try to get it close to you. I know I'm not in my normal setting, guys, so it may be a little different. Is my camera going to focus? Maybe not because of the glare. But anyway, can you see it? There, that might be the best that I can show you guys. But it's got little flowers on here. It looks like peonies and dogwood. But I'm so excited to use this. So I got two of those. And honestly, I saw these like the day before. I was kind of scouting through these Dollar Trees just to see like what I can like get super fast when I was ready to do like my little Dollar Tree hunt. Um, yeah, these, there was like a full amount of these the day before. And there was only like five or six of these left when I went back. So I'm really excited that I was even able to get two of these. Stinking cute. So I'm excited about that. Um, I found some home items. I always find home items and I was just like, oh my gosh. So in one of my previous Dollar Tree hauls, I had showed like a series of makeup wall decor and they ha I found two more to go along with it. So I found that and I thought this was so adorable with the little butterfly hanging off right there. Um, everything with love. I just love that. And then this was another one. So in all, I have six pieces um, that go with like that whole like gold um, trim makeup thing, Paris, uh, French. Uh, I just think Paris, like Parisian. I love it. I love it. So I got that. And then I thought this was cute. And, you know, maybe you can say that this haul could be, like, Mother's Day ideas. I don't know because Mother's Day is coming up. But I do want to present to you next week, while I'm off a little bit, some Nurses Week ideas. Because, you know, I'm a nurse. And uh, Nurses Week is coming up. So we'll get to that at another time. This was um, a picture frame there at one of the Dollar Trees. But I love, this is like a... Um, like a sage marble with like the, uh, you know, just damask. I don't know if that's necessarily damask, but I just love it. It is so stinking cute, and I love that it says family. I think all the colors go together really well. And so there was that one, 
And then they had this one, which is like gray marble with the damask pattern. And this says love. Both of these are stinking adorable. Would be perfect for Mother's Day if you guys are able to get your hands on it. Um, but yeah, love and family. Stinking adorable. I have a glare uh, reflecting off here because I'm actually... Um, using the TV um, behind my cell phone to record this video. My um, tripod with my circle light broke. <laughs> so I'm totally, totally bringing it today, guys. Um, then I found, oh my gosh, I was so excited to find these. Look how adorable these plants are. I mean, really, they're so stinking cute. I'm going to put like filler in here, but this too, you can add as like a filler to a Mother's Day basket. And I love peonies. I love them. I have, I have a tattoo of a peony right here. That's how much I love peonies, guys. Love it. Stinking adorable. I love the pink. I love the, um, like, I guess you want to say like the hotter pink, but I love this. I Totally love that. Thought it would be so cute for a Mother's Day basket filler. And I'm definitely keeping that as home decor here at my, not here, but at home at my house. Um, so it looks like that is the home stuff. Some of the crafty stuff. I did go down the hair aisle and I found these um, headbands. Now, I know that a lot of people are not into headbands because they're tight, they hurt after a while, but I'm totally about headbands. And I'm trying to get this one undone for you, but I'm totally about headbands. I'm gonna move over here for a sec. I've got my nursing scissors with me. So, I'm all about the headbands, especially because I always try to like, I mean, obviously not today. My hair is, this is bedhead, guys. Um, but I, what in the world? I ain't never had anything so complicated in my life. Goodness day. All right, y'all. But I found this headband. Do you see it? And I'm going to undo this um, this gold metallic one. And you know, of course, these are like, it's just like gold plated. It's not even real gold, but it's just the way that they make the metal look. Um, they're super thin. They're flimsy. But I think like with an updo, my hair is not the perfect example today, guys, but like with the perfect updo, look how cute that would be in hair. I love how they're like that. So I think this would look good for a perfect updo or if I were to like to do that. And to be truthful with you, I wear headbands. I'm not worried about, you know, yeah, if my, imagine it guys, work with me here, okay? But there's that one. Loving that. And then I like this pearly one. I thought this would be really cute with um, some like faux pearl necklaces that I have. But look how adorable this is. I'm totally loving it. You know, again, guys, if you're just tuning in, uh, this is not like my normal hair. So, yeah. And this isn't my normal anything. But I just love these. These are really cute. Um, they had hair clips, but I didn't know, like, the hair clips, I want to be able to see what's in my hair myself as well. And the hair clips, I was like, you got to do this in a ponytail, and it's in the back, and you can't see it. So, I love these. These are, like, actually, like, a favorite find of mine right now. So, I got that. And then, you guys, I found, so first off, check it out. It's terrible, okay? My nails have gone through the ringer this week. It's been a rough one, guys. So um, I found these um, nail wraps by B Color. How stinking adorable are they? I love it because it's pink and it's animal print and it says me all over it, both of them. They are absolutely adorable. I cannot wait to try. Um, I need to get this fixed though. And uh, yeah, I think I might give these a go. I'll let you all know, post it. Post it on a, on a short or something here on YouTube. But I love the patterns. I love the colors. Ami, Ami, 
totally love it. So I was like, yes, grab those up. Um, another thing that I got is this Freeman Feeling Beautiful Hydrating Cactus and Cloudberry cloud berry water gel mask do you guys see that freeman and it's a full tub like it is a leave on mask instantly refreshes brightens for nourished skin for all skin types and i love how it looks like it's got the cloud berries and the cactus and i don't know if you know but dollar tree has a cloud berry uh candle usually in the fall that they put out and uh, it actually smells really good. So um, this is, oh my gosh, it smells so good already. I think I got a little excited and kind of got it up my nose. <laughs> so, but this is a big, I mean big, cause you know, Dollar Tree has those little two ounce Freeman mask and this is the full six fluid ounce container. I love the colors. I love the whole cactus and cloudberry. I mean, it's just, screamed me you know sometimes packaging gets us right packaging gets us so there was that and then i don't know who uh peyton list is she says this package says actress singer and bestie and i'm sorry guys please don't come for me because i just don't know who she is i'm just probably not part of that generation. So if you guys know who she is, please leave in the comment so I can um, further look into it. But however, she must be really successful because she has these bath bombs. This is interlocking two-in-one bath bombs. It's called H Halu by Peyton. And you can see that this one is hollowed out and then this one is raised and I guess these two would go together. So one is, it says down here, this one is a bath bomb, floating shape with surprise color burst. So that's interesting. And then the top one is a shower bomb, enhanced shower steam with max fragrance. So shower and bath, you get a two for one there. Interesting, totally loving that. And I'm assuming that this sells, um, distributed by the Village Company. Yeah, so I'm assuming this sells for way more than $1.25. So I'm really interested to find out the background behind this because I'm excited about that. So I got that. And then I got, oh, I just want to throw this in here real quick. I should have thrown this in with like some of the Crafter Square stuff because it goes along with the stationery. But I'm collecting all, thing, all things bees right now. Um, I found this. Look how adorable this notepad set is absolutely cute comes with its own pen this has the b that's pretty popular um in all places walmart dollar tree um look oh honey oh honey so i thought that was cute and then of course you know like the hive um the octagons for the hive shape and everything but i just love it Loving this. I'm collecting all things bees right now because I don't know if I'm going to do like a bee giveaway because which reminds me you guys I'm going to pull I'm going to put in a plug right now. Um, don't forget I'm having my very first giveaway for the flamingo uh, give like all the stuff flamingos all thing pink all things flamingo. I have that going on. I'm going to announce the winner on Mother's Day May 6th. Or May 8th. I don't know. I'm going to announce it this coming Sunday at 12 noon. I'm going to announce the winner. And yeah, looks like you guys have some good chances of winning. So don't forget, if you're a new subscriber, thank you for showing up, checking me out, and watching me. I appreciate you so much. For all my returning viewers, thank you, thank you, thank you. Love you guys so much. But um, yeah, I have that giveaway. And if you need to see, go back in my uh, videos list and you'll see that um, announcement and the official rules and stuff, yada, yada, for that giveaway. But I think I'm going to do a bee one in the future because this is stinking cute. I'm just loving all the bee things I'm finding absolutely adorable then just a couple more items guys like i said this is a super sweet super sleepy <laughs> tired dollar tree haul but i came across these yeah so this is crystal waters this one is sweet floral and champagne coast this reminds me um of bath and body works uh, dupes like at Christmas time. 
maybe even Victoria's Secrets at one time. Um, and then this. Look how adorable is this. So, I don't know. Do you guys want me to open them and smell it? I was trying to... Um, Okay, so there's the sweet floral. Oh no, it's got. Mmm. Mmm. It's got the protective lid to it, guys, and I don't really want to open it because I may. Yeah, I'm, I was thinking of giving this away. But just from out here, it smells very um, fruity. And then let's see if this one has like a scent that I can smell from the outside. Do I really? Did you guys? Do you guys hear me? Okay. Yeah. This smells the same too. So now I'm kind of wondering. This has a champagne toast, and the other one is sweet floral. So I don't know. I don't know, but the packaging is definitely pretty. Not saying that it's not worth a dollar twenty-five because you're getting two things there for some uh, little portable creams. But I just wish I could smell them better, and I just don't want to open them, guys, because, like I said, these may be given away, and I don't want to give um, open products away. So there's that, and let's see what the watermelon and the lemon soda smell like. Because maybe they all just have like that base fragrance. Let's see. Oh, no, no, no. This smells like melon. This smells like... If you guys can just picture like a summer field with like clover and like the hay just getting cut or the grass just getting cut and you can just picture like the pink clovers everywhere. This is what that smells like. It doesn't smell like watermelon, more like cucumber or uh, or like cantaloupe, but not, I don't get a watermelon, watermelon vibe out of it, but it definitely smells like summer. Um, let's see what lemon soda. Sorry guys, you know, y'all, I wear my hair up at work and it's just, it's a mess right now. I need to get like my roots done. Y'all, I'm on, I'm on. Mm, this smells like lemon. This smells like lemon. Right off the bat, smells like lemon. Smells really good. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited for this one. Yeah. So I'm thinking that these two really may be like true to form, you know, like summertime vibes and close to what they're representing. This I can't quite figure out yet. It is sweet. It's very sweet smelling, but these are closer to what they're promoting. So. Um, again, I'm not going to open them because I want to give them away. And then finally, 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 um, I got these Equation Bubble Baths. This one is Shea and Aloe Refresh Green Tea and Aloe. This is a 34 ounce container, guys. And I just was like, mm, yeah, this smells good. This smells good. And you know that this is selling for more than $1.25 um, outside of Dollar Tree. And this is a woman-owned company. Okay, it says woman-owned. Nice. I can't see because of the... I can't see, but I do see woman-owned. And I wish my camera would focus, but I think it's because all the things going on here. So I got that one, and I got this one. So yeah, I was really excited about that. I was like, oh yes, $1.25 for some bubble bath. Yes, ma'am. Let's see what this one smells like. Ooh, this one smells. So this is Shea and Aloe. It's called Renew White Tea and Juniper. I absolutely love this one. This is amazing. So yeah, guys. That, that, that is it. So I just thought I was going to do like a little bonus section here. And let me just get a cup of coffee because I'm waking up. I literally got off work and um, 
Yeah, I didn't get out of the hospital until 9. Okay, guys, I work 12-hour night shifts, 7 to 7, and I get it that, you know, I give a report to another nurse. But to leave at 9, that tells you, like, what kind of night I had. I had lots of charting I still needed to do. Oh, and if you guys, I don't typically go and get like breakfast foods from like drive throughs or anything like that. I really don't eat breakfast. Um, but today I was kind of crazy leaving work. So I went through Taco Bell drive through and they're promoting a Cinnabon coffee right now. I know it's plain, but trust me, this is Taco Bell Cinnabon coffee and it is so good. I'm totally loving that. All right guys, so I have a bonus clip for you. I just thought since Mother's Day was this weekend, Dollar Tree has what you need. So Dollar Tree has these aromatherapy uh, candles. This is lavender and vanilla, and it's called Sleep. And this smells really good. You can smell the lavender very faintly, but the vanilla is more overcoming. But I've heard good things about these candles. So there's that. She can put this next to her nightstand. She can put this uh, in like next to the bathtub while she just relaxes. Has a nice bubble bath. Guys, bubble bath, $1.25 right now. 34 ounces. She can get multiple uses out of it. Um, so there was the lavender and vanilla candle. They have the Yardley uh, English lavender soap if mom's not into uh you know uh what is it the bath wash the body washes and stuff then there's these lavender dream room mist and this smells lovely oh yeah i like that i like that so there's that and then if she's not even a bath type person and she likes showers there's the lavender shower fizzers. And then, you know, you guys, there's these two. So you can give her um, that. And then, of course, the warming eye mask so she can pamper herself. And then um, the exfoliating bath glove. And then the satin eye mask. I just thought, like, this was all so beautiful to theme together as lavender do you see what i was doing with this like because it was lavender and this was like purple um yeah because this is definitely not lavender as far as like the picture of what lavender looks like but just the color the purples the, the you know i just thought that was so cute and you know just a little loofah yeah so one two three four five six seven eight eight dollars for like some relaxation, pampering for mom, right there, $8, uh, maybe $10 tops because of the $1.25 now, but let me just tell you, you don't have to go get a fancy bag or any, a uh, fancy basket or anything, you can get these stinking cute bags, look at this, and how it has the little love tag, look how adorable that is, and do you see like the foil shimmer on that. I thought that was absolutely adorable. I am living for these bags right now. And this one, best wishes, that is darling. But look, the polka dot and then like the flower trim, they're kind of keeping it all together there. So there's that. And then there's the big one. And this has the little foil. I'm trying to get the foil in here too. But this has the foil, do you see it when I go like that? And then the little, yeah. So these are adorable. And what you could do, guys, is um, when you go and give this to mom, your presents to mom or whatever, just put some tissue paper in the bag. She don't need to unwrap anything. But if you wanted to give her something, I thought that was a stinking cute idea. So hopefully that helped you out for Mother's Day, gave you some ideas. But other than that, I'm done with this Dollar Tree haul, guys. I'm going to pack some stuff up here, head back to Virginia, get my laundry done, go be with my family, and uh, yeah, have a week to do all the things that I enjoy and love, which is being with my family, my pups, 
and doing these videos for you. So with that being said, if you are new here to my channel, please consider subscribing and joining me here on YouTube. I would greatly appreciate that. And for you returning viewers, thank you so, so much. I love you guys so much. Um, I truly appreciate you, every single one of you. I've enjoyed conversations that I've had in comments and emails and stuff. So I just, I'm totally loving it. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, I'll see you later. Please take care. Bye. Right? Um, let me just say, as a mom of three grown children, I think I can speak for most moms, and I'm not 100%, so don't come after me. But, you know, we just want our children to behave. <laughs> We want our kids to behave. We want them to be healthy. We want them to make good choices and be good people, right? That's all we want. We don't need gifts. We also just want to relax. We want the house clean. We want dishes done. We want time to ourselves. You know, we want to go to the bathroom without being interrupted. You know, older children, take the younger kids. Go play outside. Go to the park. Give your mom just an hour break. Husbands, let those women sleep in, okay? Let us sleep in. And that's because I'm a night shifter. Everyone knows. Please don't wake me up. Um. <laughs>